What is going on everyone? This is Nier again, and today we bring you guys a little Battlefield 3 beta gameplay. And this game is actually is actually alright. I mean I'm a Call of Duty guy. Granted, I am a Call of Duty fanatic, that's all I that's all I generally play. And I'm playing this, I'm not really I'm kinda of trying to learn on the run of what's going on, but I know they're over there, so I throw my nade and boom, nice two piece. And here's a quick tip for you guys. You know how they're always on the escalators and they're always head poking over the escalators, just picking you off at spawn? Here's Nero's home remedy to fixing that. You just go behind him. One, a two, -hoo, a three. And so I'm mean, gonna pick up a triple spray there. Get some easy, easy kills. I mean, their backs to me. What could be easier than that? Come over here and one more to my right. There he is. And I think I get a couple more kills. Well, maybe one or two. I think one's gonna come up the escalator. Whoop! There he goes. Now, I'm a Call of Duty guy, guys. I'm definitely a Call of Duty player. Now, Battlefield is a completely different game, and you're obviously in your it's a completely different game, but no, it is a completely different game. It's a first-person shooter, that's about all it has in common with Call of Duty. There's so many differences between the two games, and it's actually a pretty tough learning curve. As you guys see, I get my first death of this video anyway, because we're definitely pushed back pretty far. That's the whole point of this video, we're pushed back, we have one M conversation left, and we kind of pull this out at the end, and I wanted to show it to you guys. But, uh, it's completely different. And there's definitely a huge learning curve. Now, look at my teammate. Look at my teammate. These are the people I get matched up with, guys. I really wish the squad system was fixing this so I can actually get my friends in here. But Call of Duty is different. That's the fourth time I've said that, but I'm going to stress it again. Call of Duty is a lot different. And there's a learning curve for this. Now, I downloaded the beta you know, early this morning when it first came out, but I went to bed because my sleep schedule messed up. I went to bed while downloading the beta, okay? And I start playing the beta... <sighs> about 1, 2 in the morning and at that point everyone has been playing this game everyone has been playing the beta and I'm hopping in I'm like alright let's play some Battlefield beta and I go in there and I got thrown around guys I'm like uh, I'm, I'm not gonna lie this is like my 10th, 15th game and I finally started doing well you know I was getting thrown around because these people obviously this is the only map that they released in the beta so everyone's playing on this map and eventually everyone's gonna learn all the tips and tricks of this map alone and I'm coming in, everyone knows this map really well, they're used to the guns, they're used to sensitivity, the damages, uh, they're ranked up a little bit higher than me, and oh man, I got thrown around, and that's why, that's why I kind of want to tell you guys about. Don't make your first assumptions about the game when you first pick up the game. Now when I started playing this, I'm like, wow, this game sucks, you know, I'm getting thrown around right now, people are doing this and that and this, and, you know, you gotta wait until you get a good game. Oh, look at that guy. Look at you. Get some accuracy. But you gotta wait until you get a good game to figure out whether or not you actually enjoy the game. Now, obviously when you're doing bad, you hate the game. And look at the what just happened. I mean, that might have been a glitch. It might have not have been, but that definitely messed up. I'm gonna try and pick him off around the corner. And reload and die. <laughs> he caught me in my pants down, guys. Never reload in the open. There's a tip from Nero. Now, back to what I was saying. I was getting thrown around completely. And you guys really need to just what I kind of did, I just stuck it out. I'm like, okay, I'm going to wait until I get a good game to figure out whether or not I actually enjoy the game. Because when you're, if you're having a good game, if you're not enjoying yourself while doing good, then you don't like the game. But if you are enjoying yourself and you're doing good, you like the game. Or if you're enjoying yourself and you're not doing good, you like the game. But, you know, I had to wait until I actually started doing well. And once I started doing well, I enjoyed the game again. Because, you know... <sighs> It's it's just, it's kind of like Call of Duty. I mean, it's completely different, but it's kind of like it's a first-person shooter, and I definitely like playing first-person shooters. And so I wanted to get better at this. I mean, this I know this is like a ginormous release that's gonna be coming out for this, and people are just gonna be eating it all up. I mean, there's gonna be videos out on YouTube like crazy, and everyone's gonna be playing it. A lot of people in SB are gonna be playing it. And you know, I don't, don't want to be kind of black sheep. I'm like, I'm gonna give this game a chance. I mean, I didn't really care for Battlefield Bad Company too. I mean, I thought that game was an abortion for lack of a better word, of a first person shooter. Look, I pick him up, and look at this. <laughs> they see me bouncing up and down. That's kind of a problem that's going on with the beta. But granted, it is a beta, guys. And I want to know if you guys actually enjoy this beta. I mean, do you have high hopes for this game? Do you think it's going to turn out well? Uh, what problems do you have with the beta? Because I've seen a lot of problems with the beta. I mean, I try and stay positive on my channel. I'm, I'm in, like, in no way complaining about this. I'm just letting you guys know some of the stuff. And look at my teammate. Some of the stuff it's been a problem with. For one, my teammates. That is a problem. I can't get into a game with a squad. I mean, I don't think anyone can. And this game is definitely very squad-based. And when I have teammates that are just laying down on the back like that, it's not helping me out a whole lot, guys. Um, there's problems with people getting underneath the map. And that's just, granted, part of a beta. But by far, 
the worst thing I've ever seen is just the uh, the fact that you can't get into a game with your friends. I mean, it's a beta. We all understand that you know there's gonna be weird looking kill cams. There, we understand there's gonna be some people accidentally getting underneath the map and you know stuff like that. But the worst part is you can't do it all. You can't get into a game with your friends, and that's what definitely ruins it for me. But other than that, this is actually a it's a pretty good beta. I mean, granted, there's a couple things wrong with it. I mean, there's a couple things wrong with every anything really. But it's fun to play. I want to like know what you guys think about this game. And uh, there's the end of the game right there, guys. We actually pushed back. We had one MCOM station left, and then two more behind us. But I'm like, no, we need to win now. So I kicked it up, and we actually did pretty well right there. Final score isn't amazing. It is a 2KD, which pretty amazing for me is to pull out a 2KD in you know Battlefield when. I'm a Call of Duty guy, but uh, this is one thing I do love about this game. Look at all the stuff it gives you, like after action report and like the kind of the pre-game lobby. That is a lot more in depth than uh, in anything Call of Duty's ever thought to put in. I mean, look at all the medals. I'm not even, I might, I tried counting these, but <laughs> I lost count. I mean, machine gun, squad, uh, assault rifle, squad wipe, nemesis, and almost hitting level seven. So. Yeah, a few more gameplays of this. Let me know if you guys enjoyed this. Let me let me know what you guys think about the beta. And uh, until the next video, this has been Nero, and have a great day.